Okay, so now I already try to power on the printer. The paper is no more uh, blinking, light paper, light no blinking already. So we can try to do, uh, do the copy. So the printer, so this printer paper is light, is no more blinking already. That means this printer already done. Okay. So what you can do is that now you can try to do the nozzle check. If everything okay, then this printer already can be used. Okay. So thank you for watching my video. If you like my video, you can subscribe my YouTube channel and help me to like and share my video. If you have any of your printer problem. You can comment in my video, then I will try to help you. Thank you. Okay, we just unplug the this ribbon cable. So So that we open the screw. Okay, so now I already fix right the sensor. Okay, make sure this sensor is cover the cover here. Okay, it's it's uh, straightforward. Okay, so after that we put back this lower cover. Okay, after that we need to switch back the spring. Okay. Then we drop back. Respect the ribbon. Okay. So after that, 
we need to put back the scanner scanner unit Good morning, this is a uh, doctor printer. Okay, today I going to show you how to fix the this can Epson L3110. Okay. So the problem is uh okay, now I'm going to power on I'm going to power on the printer. So the problem is the uh, paper light is blinking. Okay, so you see the paper light is blinking. Okay, so the problem is here. Okay, so you see the this paper sensor here. Okay, the paper sensor here is already uh, dropped up. Okay, so you see the paper sensor. Okay, so now I'm going to switch off the printer. Okay, after you switch off the printer, you just open the two screw here. Okay, after you open the two screw here, you just uh, take out the scanner, scanner unit. Then after that, you just fix the sensor.
okay so you see the paper sensor the paper sensor is here this one okay so now we're going to fix back the paper sensor after that we can uh, try to do the test print again